the signal for the indicated hydrogens would appear in the NMR spectrum as, and we see the terms triplet, singlet, doublet, quartet. So like the last example, this is a question that is looking at the splitting of a signal. So that's really what we're being asked about is how is this signal for these three hydrogens going to be split? So splitting of a signal, so, or we could say signals are split by hydrogens on adjacent carbon atoms. And only adjacent, so that means the one that's immediately attached, attached to. Any other hydrogens would be too far away for their little magnetic dipole to interfere in the splitting for this signal. So these three hydrogens here are attached to this carbon. So we would have to go to the adjacent carbon atom. And on this adjacent carbon atom, we just want to make sure there's no hydrogens that aren't implied and not shown. We have one, two, three, four bonds already to that carbon. So this carbon has no hydrogen attached to it. So that means that if we are trying to determine the splitting, our rule for splitting is n plus 1. So in this case, n is equal to 0. So we have 0 plus 1 is 1, of course. And this means that this signal will not be split at all. So it will appear as a singlet in the proton NMR spectrum.